Elsewhere, Kisumu Member of Parliament Alago Oluoch is set to be discharged from the Aga Khan Hospital this afternoon. Oluoch was rushed to the hospital on Friday after he, was, he fell unconscious in his home in Riyadh, Kisumu County. Speaking during a visit to the hospital, Cod Co Principal and Senate Minority Leader Moses Wetangula said that as much as the opposition side wants to have dialogue with the government, they are not ready to drop the referendum calls as called for by some of the Jubilee leaders. He also expressed his dissatisfaction with the newly appointed IEBC CEO Ezra Simiu. His doctors tell us he has uh, fully uh, recovered, as it were, and he will be discharged from hospital this afternoon to go back to join his family. We as God have an agenda, have a vision, have a plan for this country and is not predicated on a dialogue with Jubilee. Dialogue with Jubilee has been predicated on the premise that we want certain issues of this country which are too important to be left to one coalition or one side of the country uh, to be dealt with by all Kenyans. Matters that can be addressed regardless of our position in politics ought to be done that way. But the simplistic approach and the simplistic thinking that we are seeing now uh, confirms our worst fears that uh, these are not people to trust.